want is the chance to work as doctors again. But Germany won't let them, despite its desperate shortage of doctors. 20 years ago, Amina Pamirzad and Rafi Kawish fled from the war in Afghanistan. They're both trained physicians and both became German citizens long ago. But their Afghan qualifications aren't recognized in Germany. They've put so many barriers in the way of me pursuing my career. It's very disappointing and so frustrating. Since they're not allowed to work as doctors, until recently they've worked as care assistants for the elderly. They can't understand why their years of education are not recognized. They require us to be at the same level as German doctors. That's fine, I understand that. But you have to remember, we have studied and we've worked too. Not just doctors are affected. 300,000 skilled immigrants could benefit if a new law gets through Parliament. It's a real milestone, because finally there will be a right, a legal right, to have foreign qualifications assessed for recognition. And the law stipulates that the decision has to be made quickly and that people have to be told if they are missing qualifications and how they can make them up. So that's three important improvements over the situation we've had thus far. But the opposition says the new law doesn't go far enough. Not everyone's qualifications will be fully recognized. In many cases, they'll only be partially recognized. That means some people will need to obtain more qualifications before they can work in their profession. And this law doesn't make any provision for those people to get the extra training they'll need. Amena and Rafi too are skeptical about how much the new law will change. For the past year, they've been going to a training course for immigrants to prepare for an exam meant to determine whether their qualifications meet German standards. But there are no rules about what the exam should cover. And the new law doesn't change that. So people will still end up facing unpleasant surprises. Last week I registered for the exam because the course is coming to an end. But then I got a letter from the authorities stating that four subjects have been added, which I wasn't aware of. And I don't know what kind of exam it's going to be, whether it will concentrate on strengths or deficits. But it will definitely include a number of subjects that we haven't covered in this course. It's all so unclear. But Amena and her fellow students want to fight for the right to make use of their qualifications and prove to the German government that they are good doctors, whether the new law is passed or not.